Hi everybody, I am Matthew Philip, Financial Advisor and Chief Accounts Officer of Kongan Railway Corporation Limited. Kongan Railway is a public sector undertaking under the Ministry of Railways. We operate trains from a place called Roha in Maharashtra to Thopur in Karnataka. Kongan Railway is a unique organization in many ways. When we started the train operations, Kongan Railway started depending on IT systems heavily. All our interdepartment activities are interface through our own ERP system called Kongan Railway Railway Application Package. When the e-governance has become very prominent and the Government of India has decided that e-governance should be implemented in all departments, at least by 2017, KRCL also took a big initiative. We have taken this initiative forward in collaboration with National Informatics Center. So we rolled out our e-office system from 1st April 2015. Kongan Railway has its headquarters in Navi Mumbai, it's in Maharashtra. Also it has offices at Karwar in Karnataka, in Goa, Madhugao, and we also do a lot of projects in different parts of the country. So we have offices situated different places of the country. So it was all the more important for us to have a system which is similar to this e-office system which will enable us to seamlessly transfer files from one office to the other office. As I said earlier, because from the beginning we have an inclination to have a computer based system and all our people were in working in computer systems so it was a bit easy for us to integrate into the e-office system but nevertheless it has got its own anxious moments when we started the system because people start work for so many years in a normal uh, office setup where you see files you write on the files you read you take copies. Now all of a sudden you have to switch over to a system where everything is in soft format and you have to comprehend and read on the screens. Of course it was some difficulty was there but it was very for a short while when we started the system people started appreciating the benefits of the EOP system. There are many benefits of for the system. It brings a lot of transparency in your working. It brings a lot of pace into your activities. The files seamlessly move from one office to the other office. There is no link in between. Files are not misplaced in between. And also if you see, the, the structure of the files are exactly similar to the way it looks in our normal work, normal files. There is noting side is there, there is CP side is there and all the references always you can connect, previous references you can easily read. Another advantage of the system is you are able to see your previous files in your send file. If you go to send file you always see all your previous references and notings. If you want to see a particular noting in a particular file without bothering anybody you can go to your send file you can search the file you can find out what recording or what decision you have taken in that particular file another advantage of the e-office is it's available in your laptop wherever you go you can carry the e-office with you you can deal with the file you can take decisions you can clear the files it improves the transparency it improves the decision making it improves the way which the common relay functions now especially if you see as far as accounts is concerned my office are situated different places now earlier people used to carry file from one office to other office and it takes days similarly if some clarification is required you have to again send back the file the entire process was taking a lot of time at the same time now it's much easy all the files are available with you you can send the file to any person, immediately you can receive the reply back, immediately you can take a decision or if you want to send the file, if you want 
concurrence you can record the concurrence you can send the file for a competent authority's approval the file comes again you can send it back to the respective department it happens in no time another advantage is actually the draft working where you can record a lot of your observations and in the process the letter gets refined when the draft is attached then many people see the file it moves up and up down so the file that the draft gets refined at the end you get an approved copy which is contributed by many people but it clearly represents the requirement of the companies